Hello everybody and welcome to this next thing of the great unhaul of 2022 where I am unhauling a metric ton of books. And for those of you who missed my little um, thing on the last show, or the last, I don't I can't even fucking remember where I said it. The last couple videos of unhauls, I was getting all pissed off because the books weren't selling on eBay. And it was getting to the point where every time I walked into the kitchen and I walked by that bookcase, I would yell at the books and say, you guys aren't fucking working hard enough. What the fuck's wrong with you, you stupid books? And it turns out I was the problem. I never posted them on eBay. <clears throat> so what are you going to do? Um, it is 4.38 in the PM and I am drunk. So I don't know if that has anything to do with it or not, but you know, we never know. Okay. So I'm going to be going through some books. So, John Coyne, The Hunting Season. This is a horror from Warner Books. It actually looks pretty good. Yeah. Looks okay. Spine's okay. Cover looks kind of cool. That's cool. What do we got here? Thomas Tyron, The Knight of the Moonbow. Ooh. And we got some extra cover shit. I like that. Um, this is in a little worse shape than the last book, but definitely readable if you're into Thomas Tyron from the best selling other of from the best selling other of the author. Come on guys, give it the fucking show, Graham. Alright, what do we got here? Oh yeah. The phenomenal bestseller that stunned the country. The Amityville Horror, A True Story by Jay Anson. This book will scare the hell out of you. Kansas City Star. Spine looks okay. Um, it looks like it was stacked funny because it's got that little lean, if you know what I'm saying. So yeah, Amityville Horror. Ah, what do we got here? This is Guardian Angels by Joseph Citro. Nice cover. Backwoods of Vermont hides a twisted, hideous secret. Yeah, so this is a skeleton on the cover. So that means it's a zebra book. The spine's got some creases. Looks okay. Looks pretty good. Very readable. Ooh, this one looks really nice. This is The Pet by Charles L. Grant. Look at all that noise. Holy shit. Whitley Strieber says, One powerful, harrowing, and satisfying tale. This is from Tor Books. Bit of crease on the spine there. Tor Horror. Nice. And then we got... B. W. Batten, author of Smithereens. This is Demented. She was bad. Now she must be punished. I wonder what kind of book this is. Oh, Tish and Kate, twin sisters. Oh my god. This is a faucet gold medal. Um, spine's got a little bit of wear, but the front cover and the back cover look really, really good. Uh, I have Kurt Vonnegut's Galapagos here. This is the first paperback edition of this. And it's kind of fucked up. I think I'm going to keep this because I just like that blue. I think it's pretty. It's a pretty blue. So I might just hang on to that. What else we got? Arthur C. Clarke, Expedition Earth. This is a Ballantine book. And I'm going to guess this is from 1970 and... Oh, are we not going to say? Oh. Uh, 1970 and 5 is this edition. Looks pretty good. What do we got here? I kind of wanted to keep this. 
I don't know if I'm going to sell this one or not. But this is Olaf Stapleton's Sirius. Seriously. What the fuck? Um, I might keep this. It's a penguin. And it's Olaf. And I like that cover. So this might get kept. Kepted. Oh. That is a receipt of some kind. And then we have Clifford D. Cymac. Ring Around the Sun. Look at that cool little thing. I bet this is from the 80s. This is also a UK edition from... What company is this? New English Library Times Mirror. Um, oh, this is 79. Okay, I was off a little bit, but that looks very 80s right there. And then finally... We have Sherlock Holmes, the memoirs of Sherlock Holmes. And that's a pretty popular Sherlock Holmes scene right there. But yeah, the spine of this looks good. Cover looks good. Back looks good. Yeah, that is some Moriarty and Sherlockian. So that's some good shit. So yeah. So those will be up on the eBay store soon. Um... For those of you who remember the Frank Herbert box set I had, that is currently in a bidding war right now. So, with all of that said, um, Los Angeles sold a couple more copies today. We are running out. We are running out. So, um, do your thing. Type hard. Everyone's cool. Um, kisses to everybody. Let's go crack open another can, and I will talk to you soon. Goodbye. I just want to give a quick thanks to those people who make these videos possible. Anarchy Crew and my followers on Patreon, I appreciate the hell out of you guys, and thank you so much for keeping me going to keep this content possible. You guys are awesome. And if you'd like to join the crew or the Anarchy Crew, just hit the join button beneath this video. And if you'd like to become a member of my Patreon, you can run over to the link down below to do that as well. Thank you.